Um, um, we, I mean, the estates will, will be in disarray. Yeah, in, in, ad, in addition to that, in the past... Uh, can, you, can you just hold your thoughts? We'll take a break and we'll come back and okay. tidy up. Please don't go away. This is the Millennium Estate in the Bagada area of Lagos. Residents troop out in their numbers with their demands clearly written on their cardboard placards. They claim the peace in the estate has been tampered with by suspected land grabbers who they allege are conniving with security officials in the act. Is peace. We want Alagba to stay away. This has nothing to do with Alagba. Land issue has nothing to do with Alagba. Some of the residents say the estate has been under siege with violence clashes between groups of hoodlums who claim ownership to the estate, robbery activities, frequent harassment, extortion, and other criminal activities. In recent times, we've had some of our security men wished away to go and answer these uh, allegations, leaving our gate porous, and so the hoodlums were able to infiltrate and uh, 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 run over the estate. Just as the protest was winding down, officials from the Lagos State Task Force on land grabbers appear. The various police co uh, uh, commands in Lagos um, are on board with us, and we hope that all of us Going forward, we'll be able to talk, speak with one voice where it relates to land and possession matters in Lagos State. We will be the first responders. Even if a police formation were to receive a report, they will first call us, maintain peace wherever it is, and then call us to intervene and then advise them on how to go forward. In 2015, Welcome said, back. Um, you are talking about some of the incidents that happened? Yes, and um, in, in, in the past, there were a lot of incidents involving our moneyless. At the point of development of uh, the estate, some developers were subjected to tool collection. They call it the milestone payment. Maybe when you're doing your decking, you have a fixed amount as high as 100000 50000 If you're doing your foundation, foundation, they do all those things. Then if you buy your materials you want to use. Milestone payment. Milestone payments. Permits. So Permits. Payment. Payment. Yes. Okay. At, at, at okay. each milestone, you're supposed to part with something to them. Then that continued. Then if you buy your materials, at the point of delivery, at the entrance gates, you're supposed to also pay some things to them. So these things have been going on. Then once in a while, there will be exchange of fights okay, among them. At times, they will attack residents that were not able to cooperate with them. Then at some point, we were able to organize ourselves and then involve the law enforcement agents. And then, good enough, they intervened at that point, and some of them disappeared from the estate. We got much more organized, set up our own security, register with the government, then make sure that we control crowd movement into the estate. If you are coming to do something in the estate, we will know either you are a resident or you have a genuine business of being in the estate. So that kind of control helped to weed away mm -hmm. some of those that do not have business in the estate. But unfortunately, that was why we were concerned that they now regrouped and came back okay, during this recent attack okay. and then took over, the took over the security functions again, started controlling traffic, started collecting the same money, and then coincidentally, uh, the guys from Alabo whisked away our own security operatives then. That was what prompted our protest. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. So, so we were vulnerable. Our people were not there again. They started collecting money. So these are the things we want to say we don't want again. Okay. And then so, Mr. Chairman, what do you want the government to do for you? Um, we want, because um, we, cried, we cried so loud and we thank, I mean, we would like to thank the government for uh, answering our call. 
the Land Grabber uh, Task Force Chairman came that day in full force. And um, we also cry up to the highest authority in um, uh, law enforcement, that is Inspector General of Police. And we also, we were hard and um, um, we've been granted a kind of measure, I mean, to support the security system. What we want and what we will always solicit for is to, uh, to ensure that peace is sustained in the estate. Because before now, uh, he didn't mention that, before now, in that estate, through the activities of the Omonile, Omoniles, we have we've had rape, rape, uh, rape um, situation, we have kidnapping, uh, uh, yes, and, um, and gruesome murder of uh, people within the estate, which was also um, uh, publicized. But then, what we need government to do, number one, is just that we have, the, we have relative peace now following the protest. We want that peace to be sustained. We thank the chairman, once again, the chairman uh, task force on uh, land grabber. Mm -hmm. He has given us a commitment that any time that we fight or we see any Omonile around, we should give him, give him a call. He gave us his personal number that they will come around, I mean, to, they will come around for us. So we want peace to be sustained. We want peace to, to reign in our, in our environment. That's the only thing that, that's the I mean, why we are here. And then for the families, we encourage them to go to court. To, they are in court already. We encourage them to follow their cases in court to a logical conclusion. Once they are done in court, then they can talk to us. We are registered, we are known, we are registered CDA, and then we can discuss with any family who are at the end of the day um, has the um, validated documentation. On that line. But suppose uh, the judgment now um, rules that the person that you have paid to for your land is not the rightful owner of the land. Um, um, for sure, like I said, we all bought from different families. It might be at the end of the day, but we know that at that at that point in time, we are dealing with the correct, an authentic, correct and which means that you, you you will be paying for that land for the last time, but you still have to make another payment. Well, I mean, at, 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 at that time, at least, for the, at least for the last time. <laughs> <laughs> okay, all right then. So um, you want Lagos State to the task force to ensure that the peace that is now reigns. Exactly. Okay, so is there anything else um, you want to say? I would like to thank uh, Channels TV. They came to our, our um, they responded so, 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 so fast. fast. Because, um, and um, we are here, and um, this platform has really helped us in making our, our voices to be heard. Okay. So we want to thank Channels TV. Okay. Uh, uh, I hope, I hope the Lagos State okay. Government will hear because. Uh, some some people are tweeting in here, so let me just read out some of these tweets. Um, the Ikenna says, "Is a new kind of fraud being carried out by families in Lagos? It's a big problem in Ikorodu, Igbogbo, Agunfoye, or Kofiling in Lagos." That's the average Nigerian. That's his Twitter handle. Fester says, "Amonilet are robbing and disposing people of their property in the most crooked and wicked means. Government should please address this urgently." Okay, thank you. Um, Millennium City Center estate residents who have come to shout right. that they are being harassed by Omoniles, apart from five families squabbling for land in the area of where used to be called Okealo estate. So, meaning that some of them have had to pay five times for the piece of land which they have bought each time to a different family who have employed Omoniles who come from time to time to just harass them and they are asking for just peace. They want Omoniles to just leave them alone. Thank you very much for coming. We have the chairman of the um, Residents Association, Mr. Soji Adeniji, the General Secretary, Mr. Kingsley Okeke, and the ex-officio, Mrs. Mercy Ajay. Thank, Thank you. you very Thank much. You. Thank you for we having us. You, we wish you all the best and we wish you 
peace, Thank which you. is what you have come to appeal for. Thank you. Thank, Thank you very much for coming. Thank you. Sunrise will be back and we'll be talking about children living with cancer. Don't go away.